The second international Buddhist conclave was held in New Delhi on Wednesday, organized by the International Buddhist Confederation and Vivekanand International Foundation. The event saw 150 delegates, including Buddhist media figures from 12 countries, gather under the theme Mindful Communication for Conflict Avoidance and Sustainable Development. Topics range from the role of media in communication to establishing an Asian Buddhist media network and promoting environmental sustainability. Take a look. to convey the message of the Buddha and its application in terms of uh, conflict uh, avoidance, conflict uh, reduction, uh, conflict resolution, as well as how do we pursue sustainable development. Now these are issues where the Buddha has spoken a lot about, written a lot about, and subsequently, you know, there's a lot of development which has been done on these topics. <clears throat> but the public knows very little about it. So the idea was to bring the media together. Incidentally, there are uh, people who are, uh, you know, who have been selected in a manner that many of these media houses actually have a Buddhist orientation. They are from Buddhist countries. So they understand the pulse and the uh, nature of messaging which is required in terms of conveying Buddha's message to the entire world. A major pilgrimage site is all in India. A um, couple of years ago, the Korean monastics, they did a pilgrimage from all of the major pilgrimage sites in India as well. Um, this was a very important pilgrimage for the Korean Buddhist community as well as the um, Indian Buddhist community as well. Um, not just the Buddhist community, but as a global um, friendship. Um, and also just because um, I am also from the media background in um, Buddhism. Um, I feel a very, just as you guys are the older brother, we are the younger brothers <laughs> of Buddhism, so we would love to learn so much more from India as well.